getting knocked, Sparta. <laughs> Let's go! No harm needed. Andrew McCarr, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. I'm here with Mr. Stephen Cairns himself. Right, listen, a lot of people are saying you're this knockout artist. Is it true what they say? You know what? I'm here to, uh, I'm going to prove it tomorrow. I'm going to be in there. I'm going to be starting off with my boxing skills. But I think when I connect, it won't last long. I spoke to your, your coach there, Dave Caldwell. He says you're very, very heavy handed. Um, so where does that power come from? Have you always had that power going in, like in the amateurs, where you're knocking out all these amateurs? Because we know that sometimes amateur game is hard to get the knockouts. But yeah. were you doing that in your amateur career? Uh, in my amateur career, I had like uh, 25 knockouts. Um, my father puts it down to uh, bring me to the building site, get me uh, block lane. He <laughs> reckons that block lane definitely uh, got some power out of me. Power out of me. But uh, yeah, true out amateurs, I had a couple of knockouts. Well, this is your, your third fight uh, you're in Liverpool. We all know how the, the Scouse fans, how they come out. Are you excited to perform in that Echo Arena where some big nights have been held before in the past and you're ready to put your name amongst all them and fighting at the uh, Echo Arena? It's now the MNS Bank Arena. I'm old school, but are you ready to showcase the, the Liverpool fans what you can do? 100% is to just get myself out to more and more audience. Uh, I was here about two months ago to watch my uh, stablemate Jordan Gill fight. Um, Watching his fight, and I was looking at the crowd and looking at the stadium, and I was like, "This is amazing, man! I wish I could fight here one day." Three months later, I'm here. I'm about to uh, step in the ring tomorrow, and I can't wait. I'm glad you mentioned Jordan Gill because I, I, again, I mentioned it to Dave Colbert as well that the stable you're in and Laron Richards, IBO world champion, and the inspiration you must have drawn from Jordan Gill and that European title fight. You've got Hopi Price in there as well, an outstanding young fighter coming through. So. Right now, for you, a young fighter yourself at only 19 years old, only going into his third professional fight, you must be bouncing and learning off these guys every single training session. What's it like in that, in that gym right now? Do you know what? We all just go in there, we work, we have fun, and we develop. Um, the sparring we have is fantastic between the, the four of us. We have Zoltan Zerbek as well, who only fought last week. And it's just uh, rounds and rounds and rounds. It's amazing. Talking about, I want you to mention Jordan Gill, but when that fight in the, that European title fight, the drama and stuff like a lot of fighters, they, they maybe look at that and sometimes wish they can get involved in a fight like that. Is that what you, when, he, when you saw Jordan in that fight, did you think ah, I want to be in a tear up like that one day? Um, I don't think he, um, I don't think he would have wanted the fight to go that way. But this is what he had to do to become champion, and if uh, if it comes down to that, that's what you got to do. So what we have to do. Irish boxing right now is, is there's some talented, talented young fighters, man. You've got Pierce O'Leary, do you know what I mean? You've got Paddy O'Donovan, you've got McCollin still there at that world level. Do you know what I mean? So Irish boxing's booming right now and you're only 19 years old, so a lot of people always ask, when's the next Irish champion? When's the next uh, star from Ireland coming from? Are you that guy? I'm looking to become Ireland's next superstar. I want to be, by the time I'm done boxing, I want to be known as one of the best Irish boxers to ever come out of Ireland. One final one for me then, like I said, the knockout artist, if I had to put a bet on you, will I go for the stoppage? Is there going to be a stoppage tomorrow night? I think there will be a stoppage tomorrow night. I think uh, save money if you do put down a knockout. There we go. Well, I'm, I'm going to put, go at the bookies right now. Listen, Steve, thank you so much for doing this, Fightful TV, and I'll see you tomorrow night. Thank you, mate. Thank you. You're getting knocked, Sparta. <laughs> Let's go! No harm needed. Welcome, Team Everlast, to the Team Everlast Fitness Act. Download the Everlast Fitness app and find your greatness within.